a flying donut. <laughs> yeah, that's a donut. Flying donut video, take one. Oddball. We have donuts from space. Greetings, Earthlings. It's Shane with Oddball Cards. And your time, it is August 14, 2024. We're going to take the time machine back to 2023. I was having some good conversations with our friend and longtime listener, Kurt Snyder. Also with my friend, Chatty P, about the ridiculous cost of Chrome. Started this channel kind of to do bargain rips. I had a moment of weakness and went looking for some... Oh, look at this. This is last year's. It's a hobby box that was $50. Uh, and a Chrome Blaster is 40 So I have an awesome LCS. When uh, something... <laughs> Our good friend Collector Hollock kind of pointed out that uh, I do a lot of heritage here. I guess I like the stuff that other people don't like. I like the rookies. They're really good about that. It's usually got an old school feel. If you're new here and you're still around, please hit that back button. Find something to do. Read a book. I started reading a book. Uh, Zombie Fallout. Forgot the author. Uh, anyway, please find something else to do. Go uh, learn to cook on a hibachi. Mow your lawn. Hobie Harris sounds made up. Miscellaneous rookie is a Tristan Beck. Gus Varlin, look at these miscellaneous rookies. Hey, here's a good one. Shout out to Hedgehog here. Shout out to the shenanigans. This is a cool card uh, gifted to me. It's a 1951 Bowman Rockets Spaceman. We love the Spaceman. David Pert always tracks me down. He had a visor. And one of those old school notepads and uh, said, oh, boy, I've got some questions for you. This is my guy. Have him on my fantasy league. Love JD Martinez. He'll be in the hall of very good. Uh, these are hobby packs. Let me make sure that uh, I look on the back for little words. Looks like the high numbers are going to be 700. Who knows if they'll be turned around. He said, all right, Oddball, I've got questions. I said, man, we've all got questions. Is it about taxes? Is it about the mental endurance of not smacking your coworkers? Here's an Ethan Small. Here's a, I still believe, Ryan, put you with Cabin Biggio, who was designated for assignment. Again, Luis Medina, miscellaneous rookie. I'm going to have to put these piles in different things because it's a Michael Conforto. Had him on my fantasy team. Andrew McCutcheon. Really happy he's still playing with... Uh... Oh, it's not a rookie. Gosh, I'm just so used to the uh, all the rookies with the Reds. Anyway, he said, what's your favorite hot dog? I said, I've got to say the Chicago dog. Uh, Mrs. Oddball's family... Likes themselves some Chicago dogs. Evidently, it's a faux pas to use ketchup if you're an adult on those. All right. He said, all right, very interesting Chicago dog, even though you uh, were born nowhere near that. I said, all right, David, what's your next question? Here's a Francisco Mejia. Lance Lynn, love that guy. Forgot he was a Dodger. Clayton Kershaw, remembered he was a Dodger. Carlos Vargas, miscellaneous rookie. Taj Bradley, miscellaneous rookie. Adam Duvall, man, I just love him with the Braves. They're a good fit. And another miscellaneous rookie. All right. No weird action variations. No nothing. All right. Having to put these in different piles. Having to use my brain. He said, all right. Your favorite cookie? I said, homemade or store-bought? And he tried to smack me, but I ducked. You, you'd think I would have thought of that a while ago. He was so stunned that I believe some sourdough bread crumbs from his grilled cheese sandwich lunch fell out of his beard. And I said, David, store-bought, it's got to be those sugar wafers. I couldn't remember the name. I had to Google it. Here's a Peyton Battenfield miscellaneous rookie, Zach Grinky. Uh, some people say he's a Hall of Famer. I don't know. 
He was certainly dominant. Estuary Ruiz. All right, I'm going to put you up there in the collectible pile. Juan Yepes, yet another Cardinal outfielder that went somewhere else and is starting. It's the Nationals, but hey, it's still starting. Taylor Motter, a Dylan Dodd, another made-up sounding name. Blake Perkins, Luis Castillo, and a Joey Ortiz. That's a really nice trade with the Brewers. Uh, I think he went over to the Brewers in the Corbin Burns deal. Looks like an everyday player. Maybe not a collectible guy. I'm not going uh, totally insane. But I have been sitting at home for a while. So maybe I just went insane and I don't know it. Dang, no high numbers thus far. All right. I said, David, what's with all these questions? He said, next one. You and your big ego. What do you want to take a big victory lap for? I said, well. He said, let me guess. Two years ago, when nobody bought your Cattell Marte rookie in the gourmet auction. There's a Will Benson. I can't remember which reds are good. So we're just going to put him in the collectible pile. Jonathan, I think it's Scope. I, I like saying Shoop because of the Salt and Pepper song. But here's a Miguel Amaya. Ryan Presley and Shane McClanahan. He has a pretty cool name. Yes. David, hey, our first high number, <laughs> it's Shoop. Scope, I don't know. And, oh, I missed the Tyler Stevenson. I like catchers. Speaking of catchers, what I'm going to take a victory lap on is yesteryear. I uh, was looking up the war of Chris Hoyles, longtime Orioles catcher, a hitter's catcher, a hitting catcher. Anyway. Part of some good Orioles teams in the 2000s. There's my guy, Jack Flaherty. You can go up here. Shout out to Lewis S. But we're going to put Jack there. Ivaldi, Tucker Barnhart. Hey! Awesome. There's an Anthony Volpe rookie. George Soriano, miscellaneous rookie. David Bedner, David Peterson. It's a, <laughs> another young red. I told you I don't know the difference. He of the batting titles, Luis Arias. He's hitting about 306 for the Padres. Hey, look at that. Now it's raining uh, high number guys. All right. I still don't understand heritage. I won't lie to you. Yeah, Chris Hoyles had a 23.5 career war. That's like one year of Shohei. I was just kidding. Uh, but he hit 262 with 151 home runs as a starting catcher for the Orioles. Probably eight, nine year career. I wasn't as into stats back then. Here's a Tyler Wells. A Jose Abreu. He got old really fast. Someone else that got old really fast. Love these guys. He uh, abandoned me last year on my fantasy team. Here's a Brandon Fat and a Logan Allen rookie performers. Mark Mathias. Reese McGuire. A Miguel Vargas rookie. And a McKinley Moore rookie. All right. So since it's hobby, everyone usually posts, hey, you won't get an action variation in retail. This happens to be hobby. Um, not made of money. It's just a good deal. Where are we at? We got time for a couple more packs. I was kind of trying to do a whole half, but I guess I like blah, blah, blah. Um, David said, all right, you look like you're listening to a lot of Clutch on your Spotify. If you don't know who Clutch is, they're for... A Baltimore, they're like a big bar band. This guy rejuvenated his career. Just signed a two-year extension or something uh, with the Mariners. Anthony Rendon, sad. Hey, we got something backwards. I don't know what that means. Huh. There's no letters. Uh, if it's a variation, which I'm going to assume it is... This turned around, and usually Heritage is good about writing something. So we're going to put it here in the middle, and we'll investigate it later. Haven't heard of this guy, and I read a lot of box scores. Doval, Mike Mustakas, Robbie Grossman, Ildemarro Vargas. All right. We'll do one more pack. Joey Bart makes me happy. He had two hits today. He's up to 273. With a 349 on base percentage, uh, slugging 509. 
How come I didn't write down how many home runs? Because it's not 33. Hmm. Dang it. Oh, 33 RBIs. Huh? Uh, I'm really happy for him. Not just in the collectible, but if you've noticed the theme, Oddball has a soft spot for players. Some of them do well. Most of them do okay. There's Mauricio Dubon, Corey Jolks, Tom Cosgrove, and a Drew Rasmussen. Uh, I mean, we can't all be in the Hall of Fame. One last look for uh, little words. Here's a high number SP. Not super valuable, just kind of a collector set kind of thing with heritage. All right. Happy Wednesday to you. Hope Thursday is nicer than Wednesday. <laughs>